You gotta shift your gear. Huh? You gotta shift your gear. My bag needs to be um too much. The yeah the. It's the um the gear need to be indexed. Yeah. Uh, keep pedal and shift. Pedal and shift up. Pedal. Huh? Keep pedaling. I'll shift up. Oh. Or, or down. A anyway, shift one way. See how it's not as. Yeah, it's okay. But see how it's quiet. Yeah. It, it, yeah. You're on one. You're on two. Yeah. Now you're on one, yeah. No, that's it. That's how it is. We're going uphill a little. They changed the light. They changed the light because I'm sure at first these cars would turn while you were crossing. I think they changed it. I haven't been here for a year. Oh, toward the Bronx. Oh, toward the Bronx for me is the last time I came through here. Oh. You had went and you going somewhere. Uh. -huh. And then after you had came, I don't have, you had ended up missing here. We, we when? Long time ago when I came and went to Montana. Uh. -huh. I haven't been through this since I moved. I haven't been here. Long time ago, like 2014. I know, I know. Oh, oh you know what? It's because Toyota Bronx come down here for us for the 40 mile. Oh, it's a good Yeah, and the century. Yeah, not gonna hit 30. I was I was breaking, trying to get around that pedestrian. Got like 29 though. Got close. That's close enough. Of course, this is still rough. Ugh, it's like worse now. Oh, they re all right. They redid this. All right. This is like a skinny little path that they were doing construction for the longest out here. Now it's all widened up. This is good. Now these lampposts, they need to do something with them because they're in the middle of the road and in the middle of the night you may not catch those things or you will catch them and, you know, crash into them and that's the end of your day. Oh, this is new. Alright, where does this take you? This is new. Yeah, yeah, but this wasn't closed for the longest. I didn't, I, this wasn't here last time I came, like a year ago. Up there, well, what road is that? That's the highway. That's the highway? When you ride on the side. Oh, I didn't even know you could ride up there. No, I'm saying maybe because look, this turn, so you go up there. Yeah. No, I don't you know. Go, walk your bike, look. Well, so you need to walk. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah probably walking, yeah. So I don't think, I don't know. You want to go up there, look? Yeah, we could go. Walk, walk, walk. Yeah, ride up there. Hmm, this looks old. Yeah, I'm not sure what this is, where this is gonna take me. Definitely gonna have to review this when I get home and check out Strava. This is like East 233rd, roughly. Yeah, I don't know, I don't feel like doing this. And just leaving my mom there. Till next time, I'll figure that one out. Let's see, I'm sure they have not fixed this pothole over here. Oh, they did. They paved it, finally. So the, the um, path takes you close to the 233rd exit off the Deegan. Like, it takes you in that direction. But I, I didn't get to the end. What's 233rd? East. Oh, the East. The no. East 233rd exit. Right there. That's the west? Oh, yeah. That's east. That's east, yeah. The Deegan is right there. Oh, that's, oh. This, right here. This, over here. this comes off the Deegan. This is Park Way. Yeah, yeah, but because that splits off the Deegan, right? I know, it splits off, um, then the Deegan keeps going. Yeah. Deegan. Yeah, but um, 
it takes you like you could see the exit sign for 233rd east 233rd back there i guess technically not because you're supposed to walk it gets a little narrow yeah it gets a little narrow through there so it's a little sketchy back there <laughs> looks like orchard beach you know no yeah but that's open you got people who live there <laughs> Right here, right here, right here. And then straight like that. Oh yeah, I can see the water from here. You able to ride on this? Mm -hmm. You able to ride on that? Yeah, I, I hate this. I had to put this here. <laughs> this stuff is rough for my wheels. Uh, wait for this guy. Yeah, just let this guy go. Careful with that wood, cause it moves. And I should go around. Yeah, this way too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I watched these a couple weeks ago. You would feel it move around. Hold my bike. Oh man, it's not big enough. Yeah, I can't tighten it. I can't even check. It feels good. No, maybe the pedal itself. No, the pedal. Oh, the pedal? That's where the, that's where the banging coming from. This one is good, but that is there. Let me try. Let me see if I can feel it through the pedal. I can feel it. Oh yeah, it's the pedal. It's the pedal. Yeah, you couldn't feel it? Huh? You weren't able to feel it? I could feel it. No, I mean, you can actually feel the pedal moving. Yeah. Yeah, some, it's with the pedal itself. I could feel it, it's like um, like the metal is popping up or something like that. Yeah, a lot of stock parts of the bike that are very easy to switch, they don't, they don't really invest a lot of money into those pieces. Like on road bikes, like more expensive road bikes, they don't even bring them with pedals or ship them out with pedals. Cause most likely, yeah, cause like if, you, if you're serious, you probably got like your own clip, clip on, pedals clipless pedals with the clipless shoes mm -hmm. so you're probably going to switch that out anyway so the manufacturer's like why even spend money on pedals yeah 
Yeah, the more expensive ones, I noticed they come without pedals. Because whatever you got at home, you're probably really going to use it anyway. And the same for tires. The tires that come with the bikes are low grade. And most likely people are going to switch to something that they actually like. Turn around. Yeah. Yeah, I guess some momentum up here, but when you get to the top, it's real steep going down. Oh, all right. I know, it's rough. <laughs> Alright. Brakes all the way. Very steep. Time, shower, 90 days, catch everything. Yeah, before the 90 days is good. Better they keep you, better they just keep you up and put it and drop the other one. Can you just see him? Oh, but that the other one is gonna get dropped soon. When like Pedro get married, I'm and yeah, Muhammad. Really yeah, when Pedro get married, remarry, Muhammad thing is done. Yeah, the, the yeah um, it's almost done. Line. Yeah, it's almost done. It's not much left to that. I remember Muhammad got here in Tunisia kind of said um they got the divorce, but he went back. People said he went back on vacation. Like, he, they got the divorce, but he was allowed to keep the green card, so he's allowed to come back to America. But he went to Tunisia for an extended period of time just to go see his family. But I don't know if he's been back since, since he came. Yeah. That's what I heard. That's what they said online. <laughs> Are you almost sorry for her, like, when it first started? But she, she, she just created her own... No problem. Yeah. Why are you spying on the man when you, you've done... You've and she's mad that he put a picture of women online. Someone said they, so? they wish for uh, him to get a podium make you see her cry more. <laughs> <laughs> because remember, when she gone, she mm -hmm. gonna be crying more because she, she's ridiculous. Yeah. She's obsessed. She's really obsessed. Then, then look, that guy she was dating, we don't hear about that no, guy no more. Nothing on him. We don't see him. No, nah, just that one time. You saw him? Just that one time. Him. Was pay him. <laughs> All right. Alright. Alright, see you.